See? What do you know? Told you we'd make it. More tunnels. Yeah. I just hope this works. You think we're gonna find the white pumpkin down here? With all these secret passageways, it's so hard to tell where he might be. I'll be honest, I hope we do. And this time he's not walking away with just a scar on his mask. Brutal. I like it. <laughs> Does he have a backup hey, do you mask? Hear? Probably. Lots and lots of zombies? Yeah, I do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm starting to smell them, too. Oh, ditto. Gross. Ooh. You never think about really the smell they give off. Yeah. Wait. Is this a trap to let... <gasps> Whoa. Oh. Jump scare. Oh, oh that explains all the zombie noises. So this is where they hold all the mobs, it looks like. The traps. This looks like a prison. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I have the white pumpkin mask. Wait, a zombie? What in the world is that? A spawner. <laughs> oh, some sort of, like, zombie spawner. Wait, does that mean the white pumpkin actually made the sea of zombies outside? Wait. That's what it looks like. But... It looks just... But... Okay. This, in this... It's hard to explain, but... Isn't it... You can't get a zombie spawner unless you're like an administrator or something on Minecraft on the server or something. But again, you can spawners occur naturally within the world, so maybe he just built this around it. Oh yes, that's a good point. Also, I know within the game that if you destroy a spawner, it doesn't leave an item. But maybe within this game world, if you destroy a spawner, you can place it again. Yeah, good point. So either he found what he or she found it, or she found the spawner and then built this place up around it. Yep. The, fo the focus there, perverted desires. Exactly. <laughs> I'm just glad those are iron bars. Yes. Don't want them breaking What's out. What's that? Items. This is looking more and more like Soren's handiwork. Yep. Maybe him Mob being a part grinder. of it isn't so far-fetched. Maybe he is a part of this. I think this is where people's stuff goes after those hoppers upstairs suck it up. You're right. I think that's Lizzie's. Grizzly. Okay. Still where's Captain. the loot going from here? I do too. Hopefully right to the white pumpkin. Hey, you see the light coming out of that tunnel too, right? Huh? Oh, yeah. And it doesn't look like it's blocked off like all the, uh, zombie-filled ones. If we can get up there, I think we might be able to follow the loot to wherever it's going. Well, that's awesome. Nice find. How do you want to get up there? Grab some dirt, Petra. We're going climbing. I wonder who it is. I don't know. I genuinely am not sure. Okay, I think we can jump from here. Whoa. Oh, dear. Well, jump. Jump while you can. Uh. Petra, jump. Petra. Uh. Uh. Come on, come on. Uh. There we go. Uh. That was almost embarrassing. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. No problem. May not, may not even be someone we know. Yeah, it could just be a total stranger. It is the host of the building. Weird. That almost sounds like... Cats? Wilson? Or what was that cat's name? Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. Armor, armor stand. Okay, that, that got me. It was standing still, so I figured. Okay. It's just some sort of rowing station. Ah. Weird. So this is where it gets all the pumpkin heads. Wait, you can grow white pumpkins? Uh oh. Oh dear. The white pumpkin must have hurt us. What? Stampy. Stampy cat? Boy, you gave me a fright. What yes. are you doing down here? What are well, you doing down here? doing down here? Yes, it looks terribly suspicious, you know? Oh, gosh. Yeah, it does. We're trying to find the white pumpkin. Oh, well, I'm glad you haven't run into him yet. Come on, you guys! Have. I can't be the white pumpkin! I'm Stampy Cat! I'm no murderer! 
Huh? <laughs> I needed to find you because I have something important to tell you. Okay. I have something to confess. Something I haven't told anyone. Go ahead. Where is this going? Oh, Whoa. Oh, gosh. I stole it from Dan. It was just supposed to be a joke, a harmless prank, but then, well, you've seen what happened. Wow. Who'd have thought? I knew people wanted it, but I had no idea that, that this would happen. Wow. Stampy Cat with the enchanted flint and steel. I didn't see that one coming. Yeah. Stampy Cat in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> Reference to Clue. <laughs> yep. Definitely suspicious. I know, and that's why I had to keep it a secret. I may be a thief, but I'm no killer. But that white pumpkin is, and he's killing people for it. And now we're down in his lair. Steel Get the feeling that you're I was dead. thinking maybe I should just give it to the white pumpkin. No. What? Just maybe that would make it all stop, right? Maybe? First we need to figure out who this white pumpkin really is, then we'll figure out what to do from there. I I suppose that's a better strategy. Yes. White pumpkin is a murderer. That looks like a lair door if exactly. I ever saw one. It can be hard to negotiate with murderers and the trust quality is kind of gone. Yeah. Oh, wow. Very creepy. I would whoa, not whoa, put this in my top ten places I've ever been. Yeah. Well, that's a lot of cats. here's where the meowing... Which one had a cat? Um... It's the one that's guarding Lucas, I know, but... Oh, I can't remember. Lizzie is her name? Maybe. He's coming for me. Don't worry. We'll get out of here as soon as we find something that proves the white pumpkin's identity. Maybe the white pumpkin knows uh. about the room of portals. I'd say that's a pretty good... Uh... Wait, look at that. Chests of the dead. Oh, it's just their stuff. I bet that covers up the portal. A, por a portal. Oh, Petra, yeah. did you see this? That's the portal hallway. Yeah, it looks like the white pumpkin's been there too. Hmm. Dan had this had the flint and steel before. He's the one who got it. So that's that supports him being the white pumpkin. But the the cats support Lizzie, if that's the one who had the uh, cat. Yeah, but would Dan kill to get it back? Let's see here. Legend of the World, portals, basic portal theory, portals and you. Wow, they're all about portals. That's pretty obsessive. Huh. The mystery deepens. Cat chest. That chest <laughs> definitely seems important. It's full of cats. Okay, kitty kitty, can you scoot out of the way, please? We need to get in the chest. Move, cat. I don't think it wants me no, to get in. No, bad kitty. Oh, stupid. You feed it some something food distracted or if I'm gonna get that chest open. Oh, cobwebs. What's beyond there? Cobwebs. Not sure. Should be able to score some string from those. Uh, make a, give it some st string to work with. Oh, yeah. Like a typical brewing stand, must be where the white pumpkin made the tipped arrows that killed Torque Dog. Didn't Lizzie say that she taught Cassie and Stacy how to make those too? Oh yeah, yeah she did. So that's the potion part, but what about the arrows? But didn't she lie? Yeah, she did. So that makes her that made her the su suspect, according to how she was apparently the only one who could make those arrows. But she's dead. It was the shadow lady we talked to, and she died. Yeah. So there has to be someone else that can. Is I'm guessing this chest should have. Oh, yep, we've got sticks. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Anything else? sticks. Oh, wow, an ender pearl. Oh, sweet. That must be how the white pumpkin got down that elevator shaft. But then, how? How'd they get back up? Maybe they have a different tunnel. Maybe the white pumpkin stole the um, 
arrows from uh, the one person who could make them. Oh, yeah. That's an idea. figure out where I can catch one. Except for catfish. <laughs> ah, there we go. Oh, we have water right there. How convenient. Hmm. That is some Oh, hey, Marlin. Bet one of those would fish. convince that cat to get off the chest. You're right. That fishing pole is already coming in handy. Time to catch us some fish. Yeah, get us some grub. Ah. Wow, nice catch, Jesse. Thanks. Bet that cat'll love this. All right, it's chest of the dead. Can I punch that? I don't believe so. No. Oh no. Here's where everyone's stuff gets collected. But there's only three, so these were made as they died. Yes. <sighs> Those poor people. And there are how many people left? Four? Three? There's Stampy, there's the three that were behind us in the room, and then there's Lizzie who was guarding, so five. Okay. At least. You guys doing okay? Stampy seems like he's innocent. I'm pretty worried about Lucas. If the white pumpkin isn't down here, he must still be upstairs. And I thought that I was okay because I was numb and feeling no emotions at all. But I'm beginning to suspect it was actually shock. Don't worry, we're <laughs> gonna crack this wide open. Uh, I was feeling no emotions. I think it was actually shock. <laughs> Great observation there. <laughs> okay, here, kitty, get the fishy. the other cats come after it. There you go. Jeez. Oh! Many yeah. cats! So many cats! Help! I don't want to be a cat lady! Ugh, cats give me the creeps. No offense, Tippy. None taken. I'm not really a cat. <laughs> <laughs> finally get in here now. Thank goodness. It's full of portraits. Loads of them. Portraits? Wait. Wait. Mm. Oh. oh, I don't like that. So they replaced. Lucy already had all the X'd out ones ready to okay. go. Yep. Besides Petra, we've got Dan, Stacy, Stampy, Lucas, Ivor, and oh, hey, there's me. What is it? So he put them up as he killed people. They weren't. They didn't just magically appear. Okay. Oh, me. The cats. The crossed-out portraits. Yeah, the portraits. There was one person who didn't have a crossed-out portrait. Someone who's a known cat person. Lizzie. Okay. So who did it? Yes, you figured it out? Lizzie. Oh. Uh. Hmm. I'm silent. Uh, Jesse? Oh, I've got it! Cassie's the one with the missing portrait. It must be Cassie! Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Huh. Uh, not only is she the white pumpkin, but she owns way, way too many cats. Well, come on, you guys. It's time to prove Lucas's innocence and catch us a white pumpkin. So it was Cassie who was the cat person. Huh. I had it all mixed up then. Yeah, because that's... I'll go round right everyone there. up. What's going on? Yeah, you were gone an awful long time. What's Morning. going on here? Did you even find anything? Color? We found the white pumpkin's lair right beneath us. What? Really? Yeah. Very interesting. She's not... Hmm. No sign of Cassie, but... Huh? <laughs> Are you gonna tell them, or should I just do it? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Jesse, go on. Is this gully where I think this is going? Go on, Cassie, tell them. 
hell is what, Cass? It sounds like Jesse's trying to make you think that I'm the white pumpkin. <laughs> That's impossible. No way. No way. Yeah, Jesse, I'm afraid you're gonna have to do better than that. Look at the facts. We caught Lucas with that pumpkin head right after poor Lizzie got taken out. I think Where's you're just Dan? lying to protect him. Dan's right there. Cassie's making That's a lot of sense right there. now. Do you have any evidence to back you up? There's something that's been bothering me for a while now. Something that happened in the Great Hall shortly after Tork Dog was hit with that trap. What's that? Go on, Jesse. You've got this. Where is this going? Shh. Let Jesse finish. Cassie said she recognized what? us even before we saw the portraits. Uh, actually, that was Lizzie. Oh, oh shoot. I guess I misremembered that. Well, no matter. I haven't even gotten to the really juicy stuff yet. That came. Wait. When we were down in the basement, we Listen. found some very interesting items. Items for the White Pumpkin's evening festivities. And there was one very significant detail. What was this evidence? Shh. I think Jesse's about to tell everyone. Ah. We found a Primo Potion Brewing Station. Perfect for making the tipped arrows that killed Torque Dog in the first place. Oh, that's pretty good evidence. But, uh, honestly, that seems more like a Lizzie clue than anything. Yeah, and she's Lizzie. gone. Hmm, that made more sense in my head. But that's okay. Stick with me, people. I'm not sure I'm doing this right. Come on. I'm not doing, doing this. I'm not sure either. Do it. But it was the it's a hard to keep everybody straight. It's a to your friends that helped me really figure out who we were dealing with here. Uh, okay. Cats. Dozens of calico cats, and they all look just like Winslow. An amusing story, Jesse. But if you saw all these supposed cats just like mine, then what color is Winslow? It shouldn't be a problem if you saw a hundred. Cats? Really? Shh. Winslow is black, white, and orange. Oh. I'm sorry, Jesse, but it just doesn't add up. What? I guess that means the most likely candidate is still Lucas. No way. No way. I am not leaving here without him. So, do you punks want to do it the easy way? Or the way where I punch all of you? Stop it, Petra. Guys, guys, come on. There are better ways to resolve this. I'm starting to wonder if you're all in on it. Please, I know I didn't convince you about Cassie, but you have to believe me that Lucas is innocent. No, 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 no. Please, we don't have to do this. We don't have to do this. Yes. I have the enchanted flint and steel. You had it? You? It was I've Cassie. Been stuck in this stupid world with its stupid two moons for years. Trapped with a portal right under my nose, but no key to open it. Wait, Jesse was right. You were all so wrapped in your stupid drama. Oh, don't monologue. It's very unbecoming. Some yeah, I rather... think you should be quiet now, Cassie. Trust me. That's okay. I'm just glad we exposed her now. I just didn't do the best job of explaining. Yeah, I didn't. I'll fight all of you! Each and every one of you! Oh! Oh, oh dear. dear. Someone trap. We need to dig her out! After everyone she's hurt? Dig her out. We need to dig her out. She did terrible things, but no one deserves this! Oh, that's so nice! Yeah. Oh. Oh. And she's Wait, gone. Look! I can't believe it. She's gone. What a way to go. Yeah, I guess in all the chaos, she forgot where her own traps were. Wow. Poor Cassie. She did some terrible things, but no one deserves to be trapped away from home like that. If oh. only she had just asked us for help, we could have avoided this whole thing. Where was she from originally? Hey, it's morning. I'm not sure. Whew. I guess... I guess that's it then. Yeah, we're free. And we're alive. Let's not waste it standing around. There could still be traps everywhere in here. I really still feel guilty about letting that one girl die. LD Shadow Lady. I wish there was a way to save them all. Yep. I don't suppose that's kind of the point of this part of the game. Yeah. Oh. I've never been so happy to smell rotting flesh. <laughs> yeah, that is... Yikes, that is pretty rank. I 
feel bad thinking about the people who aren't here to smell it. Talk Dog, Sparkles, Lizzie, and Cassie, I guess. Uh, that's a good point. Yeah, I didn't mean to depress anyone. I just can't stop thinking about them. I tried yeah. my hardest, but there was nothing I could do. Oh, we all know that, Jesse. It's not your fault. Lucky for us, that portal brought you here. Speaking of which, I have no idea how to begin finding our exit portal. Well, Cassie said it was right under her nose, right? That's true. Maybe it's nearby. Ah, oh, there we go. There you go. Hey, what do you know? There it is. A fabulous coincidence! So, I guess this is goodbye, huh? Yeah. Just let us know if you ever accidentally find yourselves in our world. <laughs> That's really nice of you, but I don't think we can really portal hop without a portal key. Oh, uh, well, I think Stampy's got you covered there. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, that's right. I almost forgot about that. It was just meant to be a prank. A harmless prank. And I'm so sorry. So very, very sorry. Yeah, come on. It's Stampy. You know he would never actually try to yeah. hurt anyone. And so the drama continues. <laughs> Fascinating. <laughs> it's cool. Guys, you can share it. And make, like, your own Order of the Stone. Yeah, all right. I guess I can live with <gasps> yes, that. That's a wonderful idea. Cool. Yeah. Well, I'm not great at goodbyes, so I'm actually just going to start walking home. Thanks for everything. Yeah, me too. Travel safe, you guys. Bye. Bye, Stampy. What a strange, strange bunch of individuals. <sighs> Cassie, what's her name, was talking about being trapped here. You know, I wonder if there is a way to save them all. You know? I doubt it. Yeah. Because I think having Torque die is a scripted event. Yeah, but I wonder if not telling Kevin Sparkles about your your Flynn steel could change it. Yeah, I wonder. And then I had, I didn't realize it, would cho it was a choice, and I accidentally chose to follow the, the white pumpkin instead of ch saving... Uh, it's okay. I would have chosen that. Another too. world. I was what really eager to was see one who of was. the old he was. Portal keys, other worlds. It all adds up, I guess. I know. Man, that's too bad if it's true. Seeing as she turned out to be, you know, the white pumpkin and all. Yes. Hadn't thought about that. I just can't believe that we finally met someone who might be an old builder, and she's a pumpkin-wearing serial killer. Yeah. Typical. Well, here we are. Would you care to do the honors, Jesse? Well, where to next? The only prize. It didn't work. Huh? What? We need stampies. Oh god. That's weird. Winslow? That's oh. oh. Oh no! Cassie! You Oh. She's probably not even dead. 